forget about the car companies. JCB is now the quintessential British manufacturer, and this is its latest addition to its ag lineup. It's called the Fast Track 8330, and we want to know is it as burly and mean as it looks? The simple answer is yes. Have a look at it. It is a brute, this thing. But this Brit isn't a prim and proper Oxford professor style of Brit. This is more soccer hooligan with a fresh set of kicks. But I like that. And I want to show you why. Welcome aboard the JCB Fast Track 8330. And as I was mentioning earlier, it is a brute. I'm saying that because I think it's in a league of its own. There's not a tractor out there that can do what this can do. Spec wise, uh, the JCB Fast Track offers an 8.4 litre Agco engine. And this model will pump out about 350 max horsepower. Now, that's not uncommon in tractors. But what's uncommon is the fact that this thing can go 70 kilometres an hour. Now, that is ridiculous. Yes, if you look at the label, it reads Fast Track, and I think that's its big marketing point. But its real selling point, I think, for farmers out there or people that would be interested in this sort of tractor is actually its comfort. And you, you can't go fast in this thing without being comfortable. Unlike most traditional tractors that sit up on its rear wheels, the cabin is actually situated in between the front and the rear wheels. So you've got suspension on each axle here, not riding all the bumps on the rears. Now, I will admit, it's not the fanciest tractor inside at all, but you just feel like when you hop on board that this thing means business. Like, it's, it's ready for the fight. Ah, this thing just wants to go. So, now that we've removed and ditched the implement, I can really experience just the tractor by itself. Now, let's, I'm just going to quickly talk about the transmission. It's actually got three drive modes. You've got drive mode, which I'm in now, which is essentially uh, like automatic can. You've also got manual mode, where you can toggle and increment the speed just on your joystick here. So you go up in percentages, you know, toggle it, go a little bit faster by a couple of percent. And then you've also got power shift mode, and that's for the oldies who still, uh, you know, want that sensation of driving a manual uh, Massey Ferguson tractor or something like that, where you got to really clink in the gears. Um, personally, though, for what I'm about to do, paddock bashing, bloody, bloody press drive and foot to the floor, and it should kick off. I hit that at 25 kilometres an hour. Oh, I'm sorry, if I was in a, a more traditional style tractor, I reckon I would have been halfway to the moon. That would have bounced me out. <laughs> 30 kilometres an hour, I'm just gliding over these. And there's some serious potholes and divots in this soil. Like, this isn't, uh, this isn't fresh tarmac, and I'm at 40 kilometres an hour. This is just freaking good. That, that's what's amazing about it, you know? It's unique. And I can see yeah, how enticing it is for farmers, and especially contractors, that, that you, you can do a bit of towing. Uh, you know, obviously, put a cart on the back. You can put some mowers on, uh, tillage equipment. But at the end of the day, you can do it in the, in the paddock at 10 or 15 kilometres faster than a traditional tractor. So I don't want to call it a Swiss army knife because it's British, but is there such a thing as a British army knife? Maybe the Brits aren't boring after all. Maybe they're not. Maybe they're not all toffs. Maybe, maybe there are some thrill seekers in the, uh, in the British Isles. I don't know. We don't have this manufacturing capabilities anymore. We, we're, not, we're not building our own cars. We're not building our own tractors. And I think as an Aussie, I'm a little bit envious. You know, we love to hate them. But credit where credit's due, I think they've made a freaking awesome tractor.
Here are five things we love about the JCB Fast Track 8330. Under the bonnet, the Fast Track has an 8.4 litre Agco engine that pushes out about 350 max horsepower, all thanks to that really massive turbo on the top there. Imagine that on your Commodore. Fact, you should never go anywhere in Australia without an Esky. Thankfully, the Fast Track has us covered. Oh, perfect timing. Unlike the typical British backpacker, the Fast Track won't get sunburnt under the Aussie sun. Plus, they don't drink warm beer, which is good. Did you know that in Australia, leather seats come as standard with the Fast Track? True to its name, the Fast Track is fast. It's actually the fastest production tractor in the world. And it'll reach speeds of about 70 kilometres an hour. And it will do it anywhere. Hmm. Anywhere. 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 Thing. I want a JCB fast track. Before the break, I was tooling around a farm in the impressive JCB fast track, and it's fair to say I was in love with it. This thing is naughty. It doesn't feel right. Oh, oh, but it feels so good at the same time. Oh, how good. You naughty fast track. It's just a little bit early there. Oh, it's going to be in the bloopers, won't it? Finishing too early. That's a bit weird. I didn't mean to say that. <sighs> a lovely day in the office. I mentioned before the JCB fast track was the fastest production tractor in the world, but I think it's time to say hello to its sinister big brother, the fast track two. At the end of 2019, this thing broke the Guinness World Record for the fastest tractor in the world, topping out at a whopping 217 kilometres per hour. Yes, you heard that correctly, 217. We couldn't get hold of the Fast Track 2, so we decided to have a bit of fun with its little brother, shutting down an airport runway for a high-speed drag race. Well, we chucked some cones across a road at the front of an airport. I think that's close enough. This is what every farm boy in the country has, but this is what every farm boy needs. And we're going to race them because we can. Looking good, Mad Max. Thanks, mate. Let's get into it. This is the infamous Peewee 80. Year model unknown and horsepower some. And you're already familiar with the fast track by now, but to put into perspective, it has about 70 times the power of Kobe's puny Peewee and about 220 times the weight. But I'll shut up now so you can enjoy the race. Backwards. <laughs> I didn't reverse, I promise you that wasn't a joke. I love this thing. I want a JCB fast track. I don't own a farm. I don't care. I just want one in my garage. I'll have to ask my girlfriend. We can even take it. Oh, we can take it to get the groceries. This is the proudest moment of my life. She said no to the JCB, by the way. 